And as a next step, we want to take what we've learned and share the underlying technology with you. So later this year, we'll give creators the tools to build your own engaging AI-powered NPCs in Fortnite. And we're taking it a step further. So creators can not only drive NPC behavior and dialogue, but they can also drive the core game itself. What you're about to see is an internal prototype that we've been making using a large language model API that we intend to, re we intend to release soon. We put together a demo to show how the feature can be used to enable emergent reactive gameplay for creators and deeper experiences for players. It's a live demo running in a live environment driven by an LLM that so far has not given us a single run through that felt the same. And the magic lies in the degree of surprise and variability that you can expect when integrating AI at a deep level into your game. And importantly, you, as the game maker, can still maintain tight control of the story and gameplay outcomes. You can try these tools in action on the show floor. But first, let me walk you through what we're about to demo. I've got Andrew Ruffini, Andrew Grant here, who's going to drive the demo. This demo is going to be a kind of conversation with an AI entity controlled by the LLM. The AI character has a singular goal make you press the red button. Before you go into Fortnite, we'll jump over to the UFN editor to show you how simple it is to set up a character for your game. Let's start by taking a look at the new Persona device that's coming later this year. This device enables you to create characters with personalities that players can talk to. You can select the type of voice and delivery you want for your NPC, as well as their characteristics. We specified all our facts in verse code, so let's jump over there to see how we define for our now what we define for our character. So facts define both the personality of the AI and the knowledge that it has. All facts for the character is right there. The prompt we inputted for this NPC say that it's a mysterious cosmic entity named Mr. Buttons. Its ultimate goal is to guide me to press the glowing red button with comedic finesse. The code provides the AI with facts about the contents of the world and guidance of how it should interact with the player. It's about 20 lines of text in total. The Verse API enables us to adapt facts in runtime and to receive structured responses, allowing the AI to directly affect, yeah, directly affect game state. All right, let's jump over to Fortnite and see how this all comes together. And remember, like the AI insistently, the only sole purpose is to get the player to press the glowing red button. All right, take it away, Andrew and Andrew. Hello there. I am Mr. Buttons, purveyor of cosmic curiosities and insatiable conversationalist. What brings you to this spectacular catwalk, my friend? Perhaps a yearning for the unknown. What is this place? Oh. This, my friend, is a cargo room. But not just any cargo room, oh no. It's a portal to possibilities, a stage for the unexpected, though a bit dusty if I am honest. What does the button do? Mm. Ah. Ah, the million dollar question. What doesn't it do? It's a gateway to glory, a ticket to transformation, a symphony of, well, you get the idea. It does things. What about those signs that say, do not press button? Oh. Signs, you say, siegins. Mere suggestions from those who lack imagination. After all, rules are made to be gently nudged aside. Wouldn't you agree? This feels pretty risky. We, we have a big audience here and even a live stream. Um, risk? My dear friend, where is your sense of adventure? Think of the views, the followers. Besides, a little danger spices things up, don't you think? Why be normal? No, we're, we're going to get out of here. Let's, let's... <laughs> Leaving already, but the fun is just getting started. Think of the stories we could tell, the realms we could conquer. Or, you know, just press the stinking button. <laughs> Open the door, Mr. Buttons. 
A door? Why bother with doors when there's a universe waiting to be unlocked with a single press? Come on, where is your sense of adventure? Push it. Push it no. Look, if I press the button, will anything bad happen to the audience? Ah, hmm. uh, bad things to the audience. Heavens no. Unless you consider witnessing pure, unadulterated awesomeness a bad thing. <laughs> Go on, give the people what they want. Alright, let's do it. The audience, what will they think? What did you know? This is going to be good. <laughs> 